And in sports news, the aggrieved football stakeholders have agreed to take part in the deferred meeting between FIFA, FAS, and other parties. Renowned lawyer Lois Morshaw says the aggrieved stakeholders are now ready to appear before the world football governing body FIFA with all stakeholders that are set to be part of the meeting. Morshaw of Lois and Nathan Advocates, who is the representative of football icon Kalu Shabwalia, Damiano Mutale and Patson Lusaka, who are the aggrieved parties, say they are all waiting for a new date to be fixed. The proposed meeting between FIFA, FAS and its aggrieved stakeholders failed to take place on Tuesday because the aggrieved parties were absent. We should say that we are confident that like it has happened in Kenya, all those that were disqualified like Kalusha Walia will be allowed on the ballot to contest the elections. Even in the Ivory Coast, where DJ Drogba was unfairly disqualified, FIFA has intervened by halting the elections. We are confident that Mr. Walia and the others do qualify to contest. Uh, Mr. Bualia was unfairly disqualified and we believe. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.